Uh, before coming to Taiwan, I am a bit worried about the about the culture. The, it is purely different from Indian culture. The Taiwan people having, uh, how about the food, the accommodation they have, and it is a purely different uh, from the Indians. So it is the first time I am traveling from uh, my country to another country. So I am bit worried, but after coming from uh, coming to Taiwan, so I am happy. It's everything is good. That they are very friendly to the new international students. So I am okay. Why you choose Utah? Uh, because uh, means when I'm studying as an exchange student, uh, I search about the uh, every colleges. Because when I'm uh, searching about the intake, it uh, it has very good infrastructure, the very good research uh, theme in my department. I'm because based uh, basically I'm from mechanical, so in my department is the good research work is there. The uh, professors are very friendly to me, and everything is good. So that's why I choose this as a ma- uh, my master's university. I knew that uh, before you apply to the master's program, you were. Yes, I mean, sir, in the same university, I came as an exchange student, and I have t- taken as a master student in the same university because uh, whether trying to another university, you, uh, to be in the same university, it will be very friendly because uh, if you go to another university, it will be new as of now. But because uh, when my my professor and uh, the other professor are so friendly to me, so I want to decide uh, to uh, what we can to sit in the same university and to continue as a masters. Have you studied Chinese before? No, because I haven't studied because I don't know about the Chinese words. Because after coming to Taiwan, the university has provided uh, so many uh, courses in Chinese in my department also, and they have provided separate Chinese language to learn for the international students. So I, uh, I am able to learn now. I can identify the Chinese words. Uh, whether university provides scholarships or not. Yeah, it's absolutely correct. The university will provide the scholarships about for PhD students. They provide about fifteen thousand NT dollars. It is about thirty-eight thousand Indian rupees. And for master students, they provide ten thousand. It is twenty-five thousand Indian rupees. It will be sufficient. But if you want to live very high, very richly, it will not sufficient. So you need to do some part-time jobs. The university will provide some part-time jobs also. Yeah. What do you worry about before you study abroad? Uh, because it will be different culture, different country. Uh, because this is my first time I'm traveling abroad, so I'm somewhat fear about uh, whether the I want, whether I am able to mingle with the Taiwan people or not. So as of now, they are very eco-friendly and their infrastructure is good and the accommodation will be everything is good. I'm okay. Uh, can you share the advantages and disadvantages of studying in Taiwan? Mm, advantages means uh, this, uh, this country has uh, so many top. Best universities in the world, so I choose this country because it is also somewhat, uh, according to financially, the uh, compared to India, it is somewhat good uh, because uh, I am I am able to put some financial money in this country, so it is good to to study in Taiwan. So the disadvantages, there is no disadvantages because if you learn more, you will grow more. Thank you. Okay, can you share your study experience in Taiwan? Yeah, study experience means you uh, know I'm studying masters uh, before one year. Be- one year before I have studied an exchange student, so everything is good. The uh, professors are good. My research work is good. So if your research work is good, your professor will be will provide more stipend for you or scholarship for you. Uh, about the Indian social uh, connection here? Yeah, there is no need to worry about after coming to Taiwan. No need to worry about because the Taiwan people are also good. There will be some Indian associations in Taiwan. They have formed uh, from the past five to ten years. If you need any help, you can contact them. You have they have the Facebook ID. They have Facebook groups. You can contact them. How about the food and the accommodation? Yeah, means uh, before coming to Taiwan, I am a little bit worried about the food and accommodation. After coming, you don't have to worry at all because the food and accommodation you can cook your uh, on your own because the every means uh, the Indian University has provided the kitchen facility and in every university maybe they will provide the kitchen facility if you ask. So as of now, I am good because uh, in Taiwan there are Indian malls, Indian restaurants. So if you want any spices, you can order from through online. Is it easy to take part-time job in Taiwan or in the school? No, it's not easy to take part-time job because you need to learn Chinese first. As of now, for the teaching assistant job, it is easy because they will offer the each department will offer the English courses, so you can take the teaching assistant as your part-time job. You can do it. It's okay. Do you consider working in Taiwan? Yeah, absolutely. Because uh, the Taiwan has lot of opportunity, job opportunities uh, in future or in present. So after graduating, I'm uh, eagerly waiting for my job opportunities. I will search for job and I will able to get the jobs in Taiwan. Okay, thank you very much. Thank you.
and this is the QR code provided by the Indian University. You can scan and you can know more about the this universities. And contact this address if you want anything, uh, any, any information. Don't feel hesitate to contact this address. Thank you.